What's up everybody and welcome back to another old video that I made about uh, how to apply materials to pretty much everything in Revit. Um, any comments, questions or suggestions, please leave them below. But otherwise, yeah, sit back, enjoy and I uh, hope you guys like it. Uh, here I've got a few different examples of system families, loadable families and in-place families. And I'm going to show you how to apply materials for each. So let's firstly start with the system families and we can pick this wall. Edit type, edit structure, and in here we can select any one of these materials and change. So I'm going to start on the exterior side and change the masonry brick to a masonry like so. Click the appearance to see what it's actually going to render like. It provides a little bit of a sample there. If we're happy with that, we can click OK. OK. Okay, and there we go, we've changed that material. Loadable families, you select, and you can firstly try edit type, and you should have a material option here, uh, which we can change, let's say the top material, as an example, click the three dots, and let's change that to search wood, and let's give it this chipboard. Okay, let's change that. And in place families, to apply materials, you need to edit in place. Select the part that we want to apply the material to. Say that. And we can come across to the properties material currently set to by category and give that, say, the wood material again. Okay, like so. The Another way to apply materials without actually editing the properties is to paint which we can look in the modify tab we've got this little paint button if we click the drop down we have the option to paint and remove paint afterwards so let's say we click paint it brings up the material browser without any editable properties but we can pick any one of these materials and I'll use the wood again as an example and we can hover over and we can see it's selecting in blue the different faces that we can potentially paint. So I'm going to paint this floor here wood as an example and I'm going to also just repaint over this wall and make it wood like so. To remove paint we just click the little drop down remove paint and we can remove that and restore it to uh, the original property setting. So click paint again. Note that with loadable families and in-place families, we can't actually paint like so. So the way to do that would be to actually edit the family by selecting Edit Family in there and then Painting, um, which you wouldn't do all that often in loadable families, but in in-place families it might be quite handy. So select Edit in Place, and then come over to Modify tab, Paint, and let's click this wood as an example. And we can perhaps zoom in and paint this edge here, wood like so. While you're in here, you can also uh, pick a few different types, so apply a few different materials. For example, if we go this black, and note that it does by face. So here it's not selecting the entire front, but you can do a part of that like so. There's another face there, like so. Hit done and finish the model and that's pretty much it how to quickly and easily apply materials in seconds in Revit 2019 thank you